The tough childhood of embattled Olympic boxer Iman Khalif has come to light after her 46-second victory, sparked an international gender row amid a frenzy of misinformation. Khalif of Algeria overcame severe odds to compete at her second Olympic Games, despite having been forced to sell bread on the streets as a child in order to pursue her boxing dream in a conservative environment that insisted the sport was only for men. Having been born a woman and lived her entire life as one, Khalif was catapulted to the center of a rabid debate over trans women in sport because her opponent, Angela Carini of Italy, refused to fight on after receiving what she described as the hardest punch of her life. While a number of high-profile figures jumped to accuse Khalif of being a trans man who was unfairly competing against women, it was quickly clarified that Khalif was a woman, but one who had previously failed a gender test due to a medical condition. The athlete has previously told how she rose to compete at the highest level after being told boxing was only for men. Khalif explained that while she had a difficult childhood, a teacher recognized that she had the right physical qualities to be good at boxing. She has faced new challenges over the past year because of what has been described as a medical condition. This saw her disqualified from last year's world championships at the 11th hour because she did not meet gender eligibility criteria. Despite the controversy, the International Olympic Committee has defended its decision to allow Khalif to compete, 